Game day energy without the game, of course, for the next three days in Arlington. Our Jason Allen is live outside AT&T Stadium as well today, where as many as a quarter million people are expected to show up from now through Saturday. Uh, right, and, and as far as game day, we got those size crowds. We don't really have game day traffic out here yet. You see the roads are still kind of empty. There's still spots in the parking lot. But as you look down the way, the tents here, they have been up. The grill's heating up. The cooler's filled up since early this morning. And this is just day one. In the biggest venue ever for the NFL draft, the league is expecting the biggest turnout. And by mid-morning Thursday, it already looks like game day. It is a game day. For us, for Dallas fans, it's a game day. I just knew that was going to be a big event. But I didn't think it was going to be this big. You know what I'm saying? Big is exactly what the league and city are hoping for. While an average Cowboys game may bring in 90,000 fans for a day and a Rangers series can draw 145,000 over three days, the draft is expected to attract more than 250,000 people by the time the seventh round is done. No, it's surreal because this is a once in a lifetime opportunity because this is the first time it's been in an NFL stadium. Arlington was only closing one street for the event, AT&T Way, where the draft experience is set up. Collins and Division could start running one way at times, making it easier for fans to get in and out Thursday and Friday. And free parking in lots around the stadium made it easy for fans to get in early and get set up for the day. I took uh, two days off to come here and watch my favorite team to see this, this great stadium I heard so much about. And it is getting close as we're watching that story. Some of the players, the potential picks for tonight, just drove in toward the stadium on some buses. Some of the people you see out here, they're not even planning to go into the draft tonight. They just wanted to be here for all the excitement, be part of the atmosphere. Live outside AT&T Stadium, Jason Allen, CBS 11 News. Jason, thanks. Says a lot about it, the excitement about the.